Good day everyone. So, I hope March is treating you well. I'm um, covering the 7th and the 8th and I'm doing a voiceover just to make things a little bit easier on the editing rather than typing all the information that I want in in. So you can see the mail was visiting yesterday, uh, first thing in the morning. You can tell the mail by um, its breeding plumage. Its feathers are in pristine condition this time of year. Um, they are out attracting mates and they need to look as impressive as they can. So it's a good way to tell tell two birds apart. Um, you can also see the female, and my female that's coming in seems to be quite scruffy. So I hope her health is alright. She seems a little bit scruffier than um, most, which is kind of funny. I've never seen such a scruffy looking blue tit. But it works for me as it makes it really easy to differentiate between the two of them. Um, you can also tell when they do look alike by their behaviour. The female will have certain behaviours uh, compared to the male. The female will always um, do the nesting shuffle and nesting behaviour. And when nest building comes around, she is the one who will actually build the nest, not the males. Um, but the male at this time of year, you can tell will always, or generally as a rule of thumb, enter the box first before the female. And you would, they'll also do a bit of behaviour that I always like to see early on in the year when um, they are searching, it's called a nest, I just coined it a nest swap. And what you will see here, um, the bird's behaviour changing when the female lands on the nest box. He will huddle down in the corner and he will get quite low and look quite dismissive while the female pops in and then he will quickly make his exit and that's a general uh, behaviour you can see it just starting now and he will hop out so you can see that's a general thing people with nest boxes will be used to seeing that it's quite a common thing to see um, and then she does a good look around and maybe do a few nested shuffles see if the place is going to be suitable to build a nest and check out and do her checks which is great to see on to the next day the male pops in again first thing and as a rule of thumb the male as I said will always come in first and then bring in the female after I have noticed about this female which I find quite amusing if he doesn't leave quick enough she seems to really um, shout at him and even um, nearly seems to attack him so she's got a bit she's a feisty one um, which I find quite amusing. You can see him here just patiently wait until she arrives and she will pop in at her own time and you will see the behaviour of him completely change again once she arrives on, on the nest box and it's a good way to tell if you don't know which is your male and which is your female these behaviours and little tricks are a good way to find out the difference between them. You can see him hunkered down there, she pops in and you can see him she gets out to him here. He got out there just in the nick of time. So you can see he came back in, checking it out a few a little while later. Really gorgeous birds, the little blue tits. Um we can't say we don't have colourful birds here, you only have to look at the blue tip to see just how vibrant they are. You can see that nest swap behaviour again. And you can 
see her nearly doing a nest and shuffle there. If you haven't seen the nest and shuffle, she did it yes or two days ago, and you can check out my previous video if you want to just quickly hop back over there. I'll put a little note in in the top hand corner popping in now. So that there are only ones out there looking for nests. There is great tips checking them out and this morning we had such a visit so you can see the great tit is much a much bigger bird now he enters quite ungracefully here falls around the place but you can see this bird is a lot bigger now I don't mind which one nests I think uh, they all need a place to nest and I have I have quite a soft spot for great tits as well but I've only ever had one nest in once now you can hear the blue tits giving out yards outside which I thought was amusing so it'll be interesting to see if he, if the great tits decide to nest in this box there's not too much the blue tits will be able to do and we'll have to try to differentiate between the two great tits then this is all part of it this will be happening naturally out as well so um, it's an interesting but it didn't deter the tear the blue tips um, they were back in a little while later and uh, checking everything the male came in to see if everything if the great tail left it the way he liked it and you see he has a good look some of this footage has been speeded up by the way so don't be alarmed they're not moving extremely fast so we get a good look at both of them side by side here in the nest swap so you can see the female that scruffy face that I was talking about now this is a particular scruffy looking blue tit but it makes it really easy to differentiate from the male there who is also a little vibrant there more vibrant and a little bit of a softer complexion so if the blue tits nest at least we'll be able to tell them apart as the season goes on this was the last visit of the day um, so I hope you are enjoying the videos I'm going to keep posting and let you in what happens and yeah we will see you again tomorrow if you are enjoying the videos uh, please like and please subscribe thank you bye bye